Hello YouTube and welcome to my next tutorial. I'm sorry for such a huge delay between my tutorials. I have been pretty busy with a work on vehicle wrapper for physics. Yeah, that's kind of complex stuff there. Okay, however, we'll continue our tutorials now. Um, just for you to know, I added a bit of more variety to objects. I created some um, placeholder roads and uh, multiple types like small house, big house, church road. Okay, but it's nothing important. Um, today we're gonna make something more for this game. Like uh, you may have already noticed that um, currently we can build, but what if? We decide, okay, here's the building. So after time progresses we have some random buildings there everywhere. Um and then I suddenly notice that for example here I have two big fields. I'll although I could place a building here. Or this building is too small, I want it to be bigger. We can't do anything. And that's our current problem, which we're gonna solve today. What we're basically gonna make is a method to destroy objects. It will... What we're gonna do, we're gonna firstly remove the visual object mesh. But it's not gonna be it. We remove this host port, for example, this building object. We still wouldn't be able to place it there. Like right now, because it it would be still in the um, grid data that uh, it would be still how to call it uh, you know it would be still there yeah that's simple and uh, what we are gonna do now is we're gonna just make sure that we also clear it from here and uh, what I'm going to do now is create a new function. No, a new if statement. It's like new sensor. If input dot mouse hit events dot right mouse. Um, and we're going to later add menu. But now for test purposes, we're going to again check for position. Great. And this time, I'm gonna just copy down this thing. And uh, we're gonna replace the if not to um, if p. We need to make sure that it, the building is there. And uh, we're gonna rename it quickly to uh, um, this destroying yeah we're gonna destroy it and um, in miscellaneous where we had built um, well what should I do now I am actually add the new function in miscellaneous and it's um, and the destroy function I'm gonna take in pose um, and uh, no, I'm going to take in building. And uh, what may I do? Hum. Nice question. How to access? Well, I just confused myself. So, how do we access the specific building in the specific spot? Um. I'm gonna check it. Oh, right. We're gonna make a little loop. I don't know if it's efficient. Later we may replace it, but for now I'm gonna loop. Uh, for O in. Uh, right. For O in C. If uh, O dot name is equal to building. Um. If 
O world uh, position is equal to bows kind of deep loop um, outer and object yeah we have done this function here I think it will work well let's find out so um, destroy and uh, so what did it take in I'm gonna copy this line here and then replace it in the script so I'm gonna paste it in here building um, building building is gonna be own read uh, B and uh, and 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 what to do now we need to all right this is a P and a building well so yeah I like that I like that um and um, yeah now um yeah okay sorry so we're gonna place this line here as well but we had a different name type so we had a billing uh, prefix for it so I'm gonna do manual on here Um, building plus stringify this and next input is object so I'm gonna take in own and position is gonna remain pose yes so let's see if it so what does it remove uh, what does it return um something with syntax here where where is it here sorry my mistake uh, if, if sensors requires double right so now ow that's sad and it's still not destroying wait a minute I have taken an error or oh, uh, a er, uh, mistake scene object goes okay and we have removed it and uh, we haven't removed it from the list yet from the dictionary because I'm gonna show you you can see we are unable to build yeah so what we're gonna do with this is we're gonna change this to I'll, um, yeah we're gonna actually just do a uh, deal I think that it works or not but it had to work so ah come on wrong place not here where do we do it we need to do it here I'm really sorry my mistake on grid B so And now you can, like you see, I have this building there. I'm progressing up. Oh, and I suddenly notice I want here to be a church. So I right click on there and build a church. Right. And yes, this is it. We have a working version of destroying system working here. And if we take a look at console, 
um, it's also kind of working fine of course it's gonna return error if there is nothing wait why does it return error there a question by my own it does it does return error if we click where it isn't in grid so it's kind of not doing it as I expect we don't need it error so we're gonna do um if own if own grid b um is not none maybe so yeah and um well what does this mean yeah it works but I don't like errors heh <laughs> okay I'm gonna skip it for now but later I'm gonna return maybe I'm gonna check it out while I'll be away and then um, if I find the solution I'll tell you but now this time it's it thank you for watching and see you next time